Hello, it's John Heaton. Uh, today, a bit of a change. I'm going to review an album by ACDC uh, from 1978. Uh, I think it's probably my favourite of their albums. Um, or maybe Highway to Hell, the next one, those two. Uh, a live album, If You Want Blood, You've Got It, came out after this, around about the same year. And uh, the lead singer, Ron Scott, uh, died um, early in 1980 after the Highway to Hell album. I think he was the, the best vocalist ACDC had. I think Ron Johnson's pretty decent, but uh, I prefer Ron Scott. So, great back cover. Uh, Malcolm Young there, guitarist. Angus. Cliff Williams and Phil Rudd at the back. Ron Scott on vocals. Um, one thing I've noticed about ACDC albums is that when they've been reissued in recent years, they've, they've mucked around with the track listing and uh, some tracks have mysteriously disappeared. Uh, for instance, this album, I even saw this on vinyl the other day, uh, with a completely different track listing. So I understand CDs have bonus tracks and stuff, but I don't understand that at all. Um, so what they've done on the reissues, the recent reissues, they put Rock and Roll Down Nation as the opener, which was the single from the same year, which is a very good addition to the, to the track listing. But they've deleted Cold Hearted Man, which is the, the penultimate track, which I think is a great track. And uh, for years that was unavailable uh, on CD um, until it came out on the Iron Man 2 soundtrack. So I had to get, I had to buy that soundtrack just to get the uh, the track. So anyway, to the album. It starts off well. I'm going to review this this track listing. Although Rock and Roll Damnation is a damn fine single, um, one of their best. But this album, the original album, opens with Give Me a Bullet, and it's a very decent opener. Uh, maybe not five-star ACDC track, but pretty, pretty powerful opener. Down Payment Blues is probably in my top five AC, ACDC tracks ever. It's just brilliant. The, uh, the intro, the way the guitar riff builds up, and the lyrics, quite hilarious lyrics. Down Payment Blues, good one to play, loud, good chord changes, uh, just a really enjoyable track. Then followed by Gone Shootin', uh, which is just brilliant. Uh, I think this featured in the Beavis and Butthead Do America film, if, I'm, if I remember rightly. Uh, great riff. Um, Got to play this one loud as well. Riff Raff, the next track. Five star classic. Uh, great version on the live album, If You Want Blood, uh, but this studio version is pretty powerful. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to comment about the lyrics of Riff Raff, but uh, it's a good track. I wouldn't read too much into the lyrics of any of these ACDC songs. I think the uh, main purpose of this band is to do good, hard, driving rock. and. Uh, I seem to remember Keith Richards of the Stones was uh, remarking on how good this album was around about the time. Uh, side 2 opens with Sin City, uh, which is in my top 5 ACDC tracks. I think it's brilliant, especially the bit where it goes quiet and then the bass, you just get Cliff Williams' bass and it's got ladders and snakes, ladders give, snakes take. Rich man, poor man, beggar man, thief. Gonna hope in hell. It's my belief. Great track. Up to my neck in you. Uh, not, not the best track. If they were going to lose one track from, from the CD, I would have thought they would have lost this one, not Cold Hearted Man, but anyway. It's okay. What's Next to the Moon? Good track. Good riff. Uh, not one of my favourites, but decent cold-hearted man well I mean it's not a brilliant track but it's a very solid album track and uh, I like it a lot it's quite similar to Love Hungry Man from the following album but uh, this one came first kicked in the teeth uh, 
it's okay. Not the strongest closure to the album. But uh, this album is a 10 out of 10 overall for sure. Uh, when it's good, it's it's just fantastic. Uh, Sin City, Down Payment Blues, Gone Shooting, Riff Raff. Those four tracks, worth getting the album just for those. And they were to do a brilliant album the following year, Highway to Hell. And then Bon Scott passed away. But we've still got all these great albums to, uh, to look back on. Thanks for watching. See you next time.